What's happening gamers? It's Roll Easy here and I hope all of you are having a great Saturday so far. Right here in this video we have another money glitch, car duplication glitch for you guys to take advantage of. In this one it is mega easy let me tell you that. So uh, first of all I gotta give a shout out to the founders, the original founder who found this pretty much when the MOC first came out was uh, Chris71. And then the uh, the guys that brought it back were uh, Obese Giraffe, Killer Gaming, and Gaming with Irish Demon. So shout out to all of those guys. Uh, let's go over the requirements right now. You are going to need an MOC with the personal vehicle storage and the car that you want to duplicate in your MOC. You need one friend for this and the friend literally has to do nothing. You'll see what I mean. Uh, all of your garages need to be full. That's really important. Have every single one of your garages full. Just fill them up with elegies if you have empty spaces and you have no other cars to put there. And uh, you need one elegy per dupe. That's why I said just fill them up with elegies. They're free. And uh, yeah, you're going to need one for each one of those dupes. So uh, yeah, so big shout out right here to my boy Mojos for helping me out with this video. And let's get started. So what you're going to do is you're going to have your friend hop in the car with you and you're going to go ahead and drive into your MOC. And this is the car that I want to duplicate. I do recommend doing retros. You can duplicate any vehicle with this, but remember, Benny's vehicles are the ones to do. Every other vehicle is a waste of your time. Benny's vehicles are the way to go. Retro, Sultan RS, Donk, uh, Slam Van, whatever you got. Benny's vehicles are the best. Retro sell for the most. That's why we're doing retros in the video. So what you want to do now is tell your friend that you just drove in there with you to just go and stand in the corner over there the front right side of the car just stand in the corner just like that and he can turn the right stick to uh to view the car and then you want to exit the trailer but only but only exit yourself do not exit with him you want him to stay in there okay in that little corner and i'm telling you that is all he's got to do that's why i said it's really easy for the friend so um so yeah so while your friend's standing there what you're going to do is go to your vehicle menu and request personal vehicle now what this is going to do is it's actually going to request that vehicle that we just drove but since your friend is in there looking at the vehicle it's going to stay there so when your vehicle spawns right here on the street you're going to be asking your friend at this moment hey do you still see the retro or you know whatever vehicle was in there that we were driving and if he says yes then you're good so now at this point what we're going to do is we're going to drive this vehicle that we just called up and we're going to drive it into a full garage with the elegy that we wanted to uh, to ride over. So remember, I you need one elegy, so we're going to transfer vehicles. You need one elegy per dupe. So right here, we're actually going to have, uh, a, we're going to transfer one elegy into the MOC from this car that we just called up. So I have a few right here. I'm just going to, you know, transfer this one. Now once we've got this one transferred, you're just going to simply go ahead and walk outside. Now that elegy is in your MOC right now. Well technically it's in your, it, technically it's actually in your MOC, but your friend still sees the car that you're duplicating in there. It's a super weird glitch, it's just your friend being in there just literally kind of freezes the car there. So what you're going to do now is exit your garage and get any sort of street vehicle, it doesn't matter what it is and you're gonna grab this street vehicle and you're gonna go ahead and drive it to Los Santos Customs. This is the big reason why you need to have every single one of your garages filled because this part does not work unless all your garages are full. So once you drive the street vehicle into Los Santos Customs, you're gonna go to the loss prevention after you repair a vehicle if you need it. So go to the loss theft prevention and go ahead and put a tracker on it. You're gonna get that message that storage is full and you need to uh, replace an existing vehicle. So you're gonna go to, down to the mobile operations center and you see it says LG RH8 and you're gonna go ahead and replace the LG RH8 right there. So now, once you're done with that, you're just gonna proceed to exit the uh, Los Santos Customs. Now, you can do one of two things right here. Now, in this part of the video, I actually, for some reason, just went ahead and returned vehicle to storage right here. This is what you want to do. If you have an MC President menu, return vehicle to storage. But you could just take advantage of the car you have right now and just drive that car over to your MOC and then go ahead and return it to storage. But for some reason, I did it right there. In the next part, or the next video, or the next part of this video, I, uh, I'm a little bit smarter with that, so don't worry. So check it out. I returned vehicle to storage, and then now I went ahead and went into my MOC. And your friend should still see the retro in there or whatever car you're duplicating. Even after all that stuff, all that replacing and everything, that car is just frozen there. So after all those steps, my friend's just standing there still looking at the car. Now check out the plate that I got. You don't need custom plates for this glitch, guys. And then I'm going to drive out and check this out. 
the actual plate from the Elegy or from the streetcar transfers right over onto the uh, the retro custom that we were just duplicating. There you go. That's one successful dupe. All you got to do now is go ahead and drive it in and out of your MOC and it will be saved. All right. And that's the duplication glitch right there. I mean, you know, you know me, guys. I like to drive it in and out, you know, once or, or actually more like twice just to make sure it saves. Uh, just, you know, for it's a fail safe that you never know. Sometimes the game reacts weirdly to this. These are glitches. They don't, they're not a hundred percent foolproof. So a lot of times the glitch will not save the car. So I like to drive it in and out twice just to be safe. Okay. Now I do want to mention also that if you don't have an MC president menu to uh, return vehicle to storage, that you could also just go out uh, go to one of your garages and drive a car out. And that'll basically return that vehicle to storage. But here we go. We're going to do the glitch again. So the friend stands in the corner. I got the car that I want to duplicate right there. It's actually the car that we just duped, um, you know, in the previous part of the video. I'm just going to leave it in there and I'm going to have him run right back to the corner. And that's all your friends got to do, guys, is just stand in the corner. If you had the dunce cap, it'd be a perfect fit, you know? So, uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and go to vehicle, request personal vehicle. Now, once you've requested personal vehicle, you're going to wait for it to spawn on the street. And right when it spawns in the street, you still, you want to ask your friend, do you still see the retro or the car we're duping in there? If he says yes, you're good. Keep going with the glitch. It should work after that. Um, I haven't had anybody tell me or report that, you know, the car disappears. Uh, just what I basically tell him to do is I tell him to just go in the corner and face the corner. And then with the right stick, move your camera angles just so that you're viewing the car. Uh, that seems to work for us perfectly fine. So go ahead and drive that car that you just spawned out there with the vehicle menu into a full garage. And remember, this is where the elegies come into play. You want to replace, or not replace, you want to transfer an elegy into your MOC and you want to put this car in the, uh, in the garage. So here we go, another free elegy right here. And boom, there we go. So now I have this ghost car that just spawned on the street. And <laughs> actually, yeah, this is the original car. The car that spawns on the, street, on the street is the original car. That's what we're putting in the garage. We're transferring it with an elegy. Technically, the game sees an elegy in the MOC, but it's still the retro to your friend's eyes. And now, just like the last part of the glitch, we're gonna we're gonna proceed with doing the uh, street car. So grab a street car, go ahead and drive it over to Los Santos Customs. Remember, it doesn't matter what street car you pick, as long as you can drive it into LSC. You can't pick any of those street cars that are worth more than $50,000. That's the uh, that's your only limit. So go ahead and we're gonna do the same thing. Loss and theft prevention. Put a tracker on it. It's gonna ask you to replace the vehicle. You're gonna go to the MOC. Technically, it's the RH8 in there. So you're gonna just hit yes on the RH8 and boom, that's what it is. So now technically, it's the street car that's in there now replacing over the LG RH8. So I was smart in this part of the video this time. I actually just drove this street car all the way back to the MOC to save some time and right when I get to the MOC I'm going to open up my MC menu and return it to storage once again if you don't have the MC menu you can just go inside one of your garages and just drive a car out and that'll return that street car back into the MOC so now what you want to do is go ahead and go back in your MOC your friend should still be there staring at your car that we're going to be duplicating and check out the plate once again this is the old plate 20 vgr when i drive out it's going to be a different plate the plate that was on the street car so here we go here we go and take a look so there we go 20 hne 897 brand new plate from the street car that's the duplicate go ahead and drive it in and out to save it guys and once again that's the glitch now stay tuned right here because this is actually pretty crazy i drive in and then check what happens when i drive out i don't know if it was my location or that we were just doing some really glitchy things or whatever but look where i spawn after i drive out we completely wall breach into the i believe it's the union depository or right under alta street but look at this shit. this is pretty crazy so i drive out and to my surprise i actually spawn under the map in a little underground garage looking thing i i think it's the union depository or right under alta street i'm not totally sure but look at this i actually spawn over here inside this garage and i there's no way to get out but i just thought it was a pretty cool wall breach i was glad it happened for this video so that i can actually post it and show you guys uh you know pretty decent wall uh, two in one glitch right here right how to how to wall breach and how to duplicate cars at the same time so I explored a little bit. There's not much you can do here. 
Uh, if you go, th you can go through these side walls, and you can actually go into that little opening right there on the left on foot. You can jump through it if you want, but luckily I was able to save the car uh, by driving it in once. It didn't disappear on me. Um, but yeah, if you guys get stuck in here, the main thing to do is just kill yourself. Once you kill yourself, you should be good, and you'll spawn outside. It's exactly what I do here. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you have any questions, you know where to put them down in the comments. But uh, yeah, so I'm going to be headed out of here. You guys know my name. It's Roll Easy. And if you like the video, make sure to hit that blue thumbs up. Subscribe to me if you're new by hitting that big red button. And turn on post notifications for the freshest and most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Road to 1,000 subscribers. I'm out of here, guys. Peace out.